You know, guys, I just realized there was like 50,000 anime announcements yesterday. Like, I swear to God, we had like Bleach. We had like Roroni Kenshin come back. Chainsaw Man, you know, get, you know, confirmed for 2022. Then we had like this new one called Jigo cock i sort of got like my timeline was literally just like new anime trailers so yesterday that was pretty cool but today we got demon slayer red light district arc entertainment district arc season two whatever the fuck you want to call it last episode was really strange to me um it was definitely more of a comedic episode seeing the interaction between tengen and the crew of course um, we got introduced to, uh, polygamy. Tengen's three wives that we're trying to save. Um, apparently one of them is, like, in a room with Daki, I think, right now, in, like, Inosuke. Like, I don't know if, 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 uh, her name is Makio. I don't know if Makio is exactly in that room, or, like, they were just, like, cutting from scenes. But, yeah, if so, Inosuke, you know, that dude gotta come through real quick. He, he might have to square up this episode. So, hey. So, yeah, I don't really know if we're gonna fight Daki this early on, but I guess we're gonna find out together, right? So, yeah, guys, uh, without further ado, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. You already know the deal, though. And, uh, yeah, let's get it. Oh, goddamn, we got that noir filter on right now, dude. We in the olden days. That's Daki right there. I noticed that. That's, like, the same thing from the, the trailer. Except it wasn't black and white. Um, she's eating them. Once again, I do really like the aesthetic of this art. Like, it's really fucking cool. Oh, you are eaten too, I guess. Damn, dude, she for real just got Thanos out here. Episode three, what are you? Honestly, I don't even know anymore. Who the fuck is this clown? Oh, yeah, Makio still fucking BDSM type deal right here. Damn, dude, Makio got clapped up real quick, though. I cannot get over how Inosuke looks so... He just fits in by being a girl so well. Oh, my God, I thought... Holy shit. Okay, never mind, I thought that was his wife. Oh, yeah, for guys, Initsu has, like, super fucking hearing oh he he hears a woman in trouble he has to go to her her, her rescue oh okay i was about to say like if we're, we're worried about a nosuke i don't think a nosuke would uh miss all this happening you know there's got to be some strong ass fabrics to crush your rib cage like that so did zenitsu hear hinatsuru or did he hear makio i assume it was makio since i don't know like she's like the only one like struggling right now oh damn it Everything's fucked up. Oh, the attic. I was about to say either they were in the attic or it was like a blood demon arc. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah. Inosuke, you better get them swords out, boy. You better find that boar mask fast. You might have gotten Makio killed. Fucking doggy might have just crushed their fucking organs just like that. All right, this looks kind of cool, though. I don't know why. Like, the colors and everything, really pleasant. Yo. Oh, my God. Wait, no shot? Oh, he was trying to catch the fabric. Okay, I was, I was so confused. Can I make a petition to make this um, Inosuke's canon outfit for, like, the rest of the series, please? Oh, never mind. Zenitsu wasn't hearing Makio. Okay, it was somebody else. I don't trust this. Zenitsu, bro, you better, you better, you know, start that breathing real quick. Damn! Um, wait, what the fuck? Wait, I'm confused now. Wait, how is Daki here, but she was with Makio? Aren't they in different houses? I mean, she's a demon. She can probably fucking teleport and stuff like that. I mean, who the fuck am I to talk? An upper rank, man. See? She sounds really cool, though. Okay, so obviously they don't know she's a demon. See, she already got the vein popping out, bro. It's obvious she's a demon. Okay, relax, man. You don't gotta call us ugly. Like, what the fuck? Okay, you tell us to kill ourselves, too. Come on, now. She's a need to. All you gotta do right now is hit him with the thunderclap and flash. That's all. God damn! Squeezing her fucking ear hard as fuck. There it goes. Zenitsu, go white knight mode on her ass. Okay, I gotta keep it real. She is not doing a good job at concealing her, you know, identity at all, bro. Even if I didn't know about demons and shit, like, damn, you got veins, lady. Like, you got veins popping up all over your face. You're squeezing her ear hard enough to make it bleed and shit. And look at Tanjiro over here just having a great time, dude. Just, just you know, having fun in the house, decorating flowers and shit while fucking Zenitsu and Inosuke over here are fighting for their lives. The Tanjiro, you're getting too creepy now, bro. I've never heard of anybody that wants to work. He wants to do all this labor. Is no one gonna question that, sh that Inosuke, you know, Inoko was able to fucking crush a, a a wall with her bare hands okay so i thought inosuke was gonna fight against naki but now okay we got zenitsu against her ass dodge okay zenitsu come on bro we fucking train for this shit man she was really bullying people into suicide bro i know damn well Daki was going ham in them cod lobbies back in the day her voice is really cool though I, I gotta say that her voice is really fucking dope who are you it's uh what are you actually that's the name of the episode damn she really got the knife on deck yeah she's not human i, I mean i thought that was pretty obvious from just looking at her oh she got the fabric on deck again wait she can fly too what is this she's fucking like levitating in the air 
The power of the CGI fabrics. Yeah, upper. Okay, so I was right. She is upper six. Okay, this shot is pretty fucking dope. I like I like Doki's uh, color scheme. Her color scheme is pretty cool. They can bite her skull. Oh, that's how she. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, okay, okay. Because we saw that uh, before uh, when they were talking when when Zenitsu was talking about her. So Doki did that. Got you. That boy moves on here. Oh my god, that man just chilling. What the fuck, dude? Yo, Doki, relax now. It's about to fucking nut over here. Moves on just she. He's just sitting there. He didn't even say anything yet. So right here, I'm not gonna front. I feel like Doki is probably like the the most likely to get killed off by Muzan just by being the fact that she is like the bottom rank of the upper moons. Cause you know we saw Akaza. You know I feel like Akaza did fucking work. He came through. Cleaned up for Enmu, killed Rengoku, fucked up everybody else, and got, you know, and got out alive. He was like, okay, Akaza, I mean, who the fuck cares that you killed Rengoku, man? I want you to kill, like, the whole Demon Slayer core. And he, like, just pointed at him, and, like, Akaza started bleeding everywhere, and he was scared. And Akaza's number three. And Akaza's strong as fuck, too. So, like, Daki over here, I feel like Muzan, if she slips up just once, if she doesn't do exactly what Muzan wants, Muzan... He don't even got a point at her. He just got to breathe on her at that point, and then she's dead. So, Dakia, I wouldn't get comfortable because Muzan's visiting you, bro. I should, if anything, I'd be scared as fuck. Damn, she killed seven of them? Okay. Seven Hashiro? Not bad. How many has Akaza killed? Okay, so we're back here. Okay, so like that was the flashback. So, Zenitsu, you couldn't dodge that, boy? Goddamn, our fucking jaw's broken, probably. Zenitsu, you know what to do, bro. I better see that lightning, that thunder come out. Is no one going to question that she bitch slapped Zenitsu like 10? fucking meters away and broke some doors with that like no one's gonna question how strong she is i don't know fuck maybe their excuse is the doors are flimsy dude this is the fakest shit ever dude look at her man bro this is like that porn acting right here like uh, is anybody actually gonna fall for this come on man oh he's asleep zenitsu come on man i guess it doesn't work the same way if he falls asleep i guess like if he's knocked out he actually can't fight you know bro where is tangan man tangan yo come help us please all right you know when tanjiro's smelling the stuff you know shit's about to get real all right we gotta go Call out that man, Tangan, real quick. Be like, yo, we gotta jump Doki, man. That was a cool episode. Um, Doki, uh, so far she doesn't really have any redeeming qualities. She's kind of just like a bitch all around. She's kind of just mean as fuck to everybody. Like she does, like, like she doesn't seem to want to be friends with anybody. Her acting is god awful. Like she's like, oh, okay, I'm sorry that I bitch slapped this kid through a couple of our doors. Like, come the fuck on now. Like, dude, Akaza, when he was fighting Rengoku, even Akaza, I was like, okay, you know, he wants Rengoku to become a demon so that they can fight. You know, at least, in a way, that was a redeemable quality, but, like, Daki so far, I'm just like, dude, just kill her already, man. Come on, man. I mean, we'll probably get her backstory and whatnot, but, hey, so far, fuck her. Bro, whatever happened to Makio? Like, I thought Daki was dealing with Makio. I don't know if Makio's still, like, tied up in Inosuke's house Daki is in zenitsu's house now so i don't know oh fuck oh, oh never mind he's awake okay never mind i was about to say oh zenitsu about to actually like go ham real quick but nah but is this a preview or like an actual like ending scene yeah you got knocked the fuck out zenitsu i'm not even gonna front dude hold on this is kind of wholesome though this is actually wholesome as hell oh my god here we go zenitsu again on this white knight bullshit huh yo what the fuck was that yo are you not nah. hey hey chill the fuck yo come on demon slayer like what is that dude you can't give me like this wholesome stuff i'm like oh, okay ending scene is anita's cool he's starting to bond with his house his house is you know girls and whatnot that's cool and then fucking dog he's like hey I'm not, I'm not finished with you bitch just fucking wraps him up with some fabric okay we got some crit oh we got a christmas preview real quick what the hell is this i'm not gonna lie I kind of wish that they didn't give us this funny preview. I feel like just having that ending scene would have been like the best, like the best cliffhanger. Why the hell is Gyu here? We have not seen this man, you know, no entertainment district. Bro, they really hit us with the debate right there, man. I actually did not expect that to happen. Like I said, dude, I kind of wish they would have just like, like they would have just had the need to get wrapped up, cut to black. And then maybe like put like to be continued or something like that would have been fire, man. That would have been fire. 
so yeah i don't know what the next they, they didn't say the name of the next episode so uh yeah this episode though um it was solid man it was really solid i feel like we got more insight into exactly what we're dealing with here um Daki, like i said she doesn't really seem to care about anything um she kind of just like yo muzan's like hey just keep killing people and Daki's like i cool i'm just gonna keep telling people to kill themselves i'm gonna wrap them in fabric i'll kill them myself i'm just any in any way shape or form they're gonna die basically and that's what Daki's all about man i guess that's what she's here for uh tengen he's fucking mia i don't know what the hell he's doing uh zenitsu's over here dying in those case Inosuke is funny. I'm sorry, dude. Inosuke, like, his interactions with his house is, is pretty funny. And, and Tanjo, he's over here snipping flowers and shit. So, yeah. Um, Zenitsu, I feel bad for this man right now. I guess we'll find out what happened to Zenitsu, though, in the next episode, man. But, yeah. Solid-ass episode. I really liked it a lot, man. Make sure to leave in the comments down below. Let me know what you guys thought about it as well. Also, make sure to leave a like, subscribe. It really helps support a lot. You already know the deal, though. It's been your boy, Ivory. Have yourself a great-ass day, and I'm out. Peace.